And today, I ask you to re-elect me as the leader of our beloved party. When I first joined the Democratic Party in 1997, we were under no illusions about the difficulties that lay ahead. We were a 1.7% party, but we knew that to cement our role in the South African political landscape, we would have to put in hard work. And let me tell you, as a councillor for 10 years, I know a lot about hard work. To bring any of our solutions to bear in time to save South Africa, it's time now for the DA to ascend to national government and provincial government around the country. And that's why all other pledges in my manifesto are anchored in this one priority. We must drag the ANC below 50%, and we, the DA, must form the core of a new majority in South Africa. Democrats, this is where discipline becomes non-negotiable. And in, in addition to instilling stronger discipline, we must end the damaging practices of slagging off our own party in public. Some may say that my vision of the DA's path is ambitious. I say it is realistic. And I know without a shadow of a doubt that we can do all these things. We fixed the DA. Now it's time for us to lead and fix South Africa. Thank you, Democrats. Delegates, it is time. Our time has come. But it is now or never. South Africa is on the verge of total collapse. South Africans are now looking for an alternative. The ANC will drop below 40% in the upcoming elections and the DA must be ready. Between the 2016 and 2021 local government elections, our party lost more than 1.4 million votes and a total of 285 of our councillors lost their positions as elected public reps in communities. This, Democrats, is not because our brand is inferior, but it is because of a trust deficit that exists between us and the electorate. And this is what stands between us and our chances of becoming a national government. I'm ready to lead the Democratic Alliance to embark on a process of introspection and repositioning from an opposition in Parliament to a governing party in 2024. Some critics ask me, is it not too soon? And I wish to state categorically here without any fear of contradiction. It's not the length of time in a party that determines one's effectiveness. It's not the number of years that counts. It's about capability, experience and qualifications. Jacob Zuma was a horrible president with all his years in the ANC. Yet Barack Obama, with much fewer years in his party, was one of the best presidents America ever had. As a leader, I will defend the rights of everyone in the party, and I will not lead by fear, because the best form of leadership is leadership by example. Fellow Democrats, we have a stark choice to make, and we can either try to consolidate our base and accept our projected 16% of voter share in 2024, or we can be bold at this Congress and vote for real growth. It is in your hands. I am a Democrat. I believe in our values and principles. I embody what we stand for as a party. I am committed to our cause, and I'm not going anywhere. Vote for me as federal leader. Vote for growth in the D. Vote for change in South Africa. Viva, DA, viva.